Hello, filming a quick home workout, all body weight for this one. We're gonna get started right away in the center of that mat. Those arms will reach up, we'll lean side to side. I know it's been a little bit since I posted. We're gonna tip forward to the hips, right into some heel scoops here. So I promise a quick and effective workout today. Last one. And let's bring those arms up to the side. We're gonna pulse backwards here. Four, three, two, and one. Thumbs come down. It's been super hot here, and we've just been having more people in the house, so haven't had as much time to film. Two, and one. We're gonna widen that stance. We're gonna bring that chest over the knee for lateral lunges. My brother came in and lived with us for a bit when some of my family had COVID, and Ben's brother is here, so <laughs> it's been a full plate, to say the least. So I haven't had as much time to film, but I will make more time now. <laughs> And let's stay down at the bottom here. We'll slowly move back and forth. And slowly come back through center, wide-legged forward fold. We'll walk over to one side, back through center to the other. And come on back, let's heel toe those feet in. Bring those hips down low, yoga squat. We're driving the knees out with the elbows. Slowly raise up, pause in that forward fold. We bring those hips back down. We're going for four here. So we're coming between that forward fold and that low yoga squat. Last one here. Pause in that forward fold and we slowly come on up to a full stand. A few shoulder rolls back. And forward, so we're gonna go into some heel, sorry, hip openers into a squat. So we're creating a semicircle with that knee. You open up here into a side step squat. Two more here. And let's widen that stance. Those feet come out for sumo squats. Down and up. It's definitely nice and humid in here. We'll stay out at the bottom. We pulse here. Four, three, two, and one. Come to the back of that mat. We're gonna go right into our inchworms. So those arms reach up, we walk it out to our high plank. We're gonna tap those knees down twice. We'll walk it back up. Those arms come up, fold forward. I did a class a few days ago and there was pull-ups in it and I don't normally do pull-ups. My lats and arms have been so sore than they've been in like weeks. So. I'm not sure how many push-ups we'll be doing today. <laughs> That's probably a good thing. And let's walk it out. Last one here. We're gonna walk it out two knee taps. Let's send those hips high, pedaling out here, trying to bring those heels down to the ground. Let's float that left leg up. Bring the knee to nose, hold. Float it back one more time. Knee to nose, we're gonna draw that leg through. That back knee comes down. Those arms reach up. Hands come back down to frame that foot. Let's come into that high plank position. Right into 10 plank jacks. We pop those feet out. In four, three, two, and one set of the hips back again. Pedal that side out. We're gonna float that right leg up. We bring the knee to nose, hold it. Float it back one more time. We draw that leg through, that back knee comes down. We reach up. Hands come back down to frame that foot. Come through that high plank. Let's go for 20 mountain climbers. We drive those knees to chest, 10 each side. Four, three, two, and one. Slowly walk those hands back towards the feet. We pause here and we come on up. We're gonna finish off with a little bit of cardio. Just jogging on the spot here, shaking out those limbs. And into some butt kicks, pick up those heels. And those arms are gonna reach up and drive the knees to chest. Whew. One is a bit of a longer outro. Keep going here, we drive those knees up. Here we go. Don't worry, we'll get some jumping jacks coming up. 
When that beat changes, you're gonna go into cross jacks. So the hands will come to the chest. Okay, almost there. That core is engaged here as we drive those knees up. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Those hands come to the chest. Out, out. So you pop those feet up or you tap. There is a mosquito in here. And let's bring those arms up overhead. Feel them. So body weight cardio for this workout. Lots of hops, lots of jumps. Minimal rest. Four, three, two. I'm just gonna continue on here. Side step squats. Up. Turn this into a to the beat style set. Find when my motivation is lacking a little bit. But going to the beat of music helps me so much. You don't really realize it. Going with those side steps. And come on up. We're going to go for a jumping jack to squat. Out in squat. Good job. Again, let's come in with a step out in squat. Couple more here. And come on up, left leg's gonna tuck behind, curtsy lunge. We tap that foot. Back and up. Two more on this side. Last one. And come on up, right leg. Woo. Good job. Last one here, and come on into that sumo squat. We're just gonna pulse. <sighs> Driving those knees out. Four, three, two, and when we pop those heels. Good job. We have sumo, or sorry, squat jacks coming up next. So used to having weights here. Four. Three, two, and one of those feet together, just the squats. Squat calf raise is that version without the hop. Good job. We're gonna come on up, back to that high knee from the beginning. You're almost there. Woo. Driving those knees up with control, those elbows come down. Four, three, two, and one. All right, grab some water here. We're gonna get into another set. In four, three, my left leg's gonna come back for a reverse launch. We'll come back and up. I'm gonna try and minimize the rest here. I'll do some intervals later on, but I'll see how I can keep going to the beach. Oh, I finally got the bug. And let's go for a knee drop. You come down, up. Option to add that hop, or just drive that knee up. Good job, driving that knee up. Last one. We're gonna come down to our mountain climbers. Driving those knees to chest. Four, three, two, and when we reach back, down dog, toe touch, reset. Back and up. So you're reaching back for the opposite foot. Back and up. And come back to that high plank. Nice and slow, we're gonna drive, drop those knees down. Down, come back to that plank. Three, two, and one. Back up to the feet. Right leg is going. Reverse. And up. 
Good job. You have that knee drive coming up, same as before. And let's add the knee drive. We come back and up. Option at the hop here. Woo. Good job. Last two. And come on down for those mountain climbs. Let's go. Driving those knees to chest. Four, three, two, we're gonna go to plank jacks. Let's go. Out, out. Keep that bum down, you're in that plank position. Hands are right below the shoulders. Almost there. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. And done. Whew. All right. I like every song like this right now. We're gonna go into an interval set, okay? So what we're gonna do, Tabata, nice and quick, okay? So for this Tabata, I'm gonna pause the music, so I'm gonna keep that song. For the Tabata, what you're gonna do, exercise number one, we're gonna do that sumo squat, we come down, you reach overhead, nice and quick. That's exercise number one. Number two, we're gonna come down into that high plank position, cross body mountain climbers, the knee comes across the opposite elbow. For the last 10 seconds of each minute, option to hold a low plank, okay? So I will give you the 10 seconds to rest after the sumo squats, okay? We're going through four rounds. I'm gonna wait for that drop. Four, three, two, let's go. We come down and up. Whatever pace you need here, it's 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, okay? not need to go with me necessarily. You reach those arms up overhead. Good job. And rest for that active recovery. Woo. Oh, we're gonna get the drop perfectly. Come on down for those cross body mountain climbers. And let's go, the knee comes across, opposite elbow. Good job. You're bringing that knee up and over. Five seconds here. Then option to rest or hold that plank. And rest or plank for 10. Good job. Three, two, back up to the feet. Let's go right into it. Down and reach. Reaching those arms up overhead, we're driving the knees out in line with the toes here. Squeeze the glutes at the top. Two, one more. And rest. Coming down to those cross body mountain climbers. Two, let's go round two. Round two of four. Driving that knee up and over. Less than five seconds here. Come on down, hold that plank or you rest. Always option to bring the knees down if you need. Two, back up to the feet, let's go. Two more squats. Not giving a lot of rest here. Take what you need. Those arms up overhead. Good job, you have five seconds. Last one. And rest. Woo. Second last time, cross body mountain climbers. Let's go. Bringing that knee up and over. Job. We have one minute left here. One more round of this Tabata. Woo. Back up to the feet. Let's go. Sumo reach last time. So whatever pace you need here, 
We'll give us an extended break after this. Driving those arms up overhead. Last two. One more. And rest. Come on down, cross body mountain climbers in two. Let's go. We're all gonna hold that plank at the end. Halfway there. Drive those knees up. Three, two, and come on down. We hold for 10 seconds. In three, two, and rest. Woo! All right. Grab some water here. I am quite sweaty. <laughs> it's so warm out. I'm gonna go into another to the beat style. It's gonna be more of an inchworm set, okay? So, we're gonna start at the back of that mat if your mat is facing me, okay? Starting with those um, good mornings, okay? In four, four, three, two, and let's go. We're gonna shoot the hips back and up, back, up. We have squats coming up. Keep those hands up, prisoner squat. Down and up. It's a little loud. We squeeze those glutes at the top. Last squat. And we're gonna walk it out to our high plank position. We walk it back, little hop at the top. We walk it out to plank, walk it back, hop. That hop can also be a calf raise. Just up and down. A couple more here. Last one, we're gonna stay at the top of that mat. We're gonna surrender, down, down, up, drive. So we're bringing that knee up. And we're gonna come up, right into those squat jacks. Good job. We're gonna add a jumping jack with this. Jack to squat, like we're doing in that warm up. We're gonna come down to those plank jacks. Out, out. Whatever pace you need here. Four, three, two, we reach back, down dog, toe touch, back. We drive that knee to chest. So the down dog mountain climber here, I reset the shoulders, bring the hips high, drive that knee in. And we're gonna come back up to the feet. Give those arms a bit of a shake. Curtsy lunge with the left. Back and up. We're gonna pulse at the bottom of this one. Down. Four, three, two, and one switch sides, right leg. And up. Last four, three, two, one more here. We'll come down, we pulse the bottom. In four, three, two, come on back. We're going back to those inchworms. Little hop or calf raise. Good job, you're almost there. Woo. 
One more here. And rest. Woo. All right, that one was a little all over the place, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> We're gonna go back to my actual playlist. We're gonna get into a set of intervals here. Three rounds, 30 seconds. Turn that down a little bit. What we'll do for our first exercise, okay? We're gonna go to that side step squat, nice and quick. Two with jumping jack in the center. Side step, jack. That's exercise number one, okay? Number two, we're gonna come down into that sideline push-up. So as if we're going to sleep, that bottom arm comes up, the top arm is pressing us back up to that high plank position. I hate those ones just as much as you do. If you hate them too much, you can go into those tricep dips with a march instead. So we dip, march. That would be your modification, okay? Last move that you will do here, we're gonna get into that core a little bit. We're gonna come down. I'm gonna hug the knees into the chest. We come in, out, up, down, okay? That is exercise number three. Whew. All right, we're coming up to the feet here, going to that side step squat to jack. In four, three, two, let's go. So a little side step, option to touch the ground if you want. If you're really tall and that's too far away, that's fine. Down, little jack. We're going down for that sideline push-up, last one. And come on down, I'm gonna go with my right arm first. Coming down onto my left side, we press up and down. So I'm trying to straighten that top arm here. My left arm is up, grabbing for those lats, okay? Kind of below the armpit. You're halfway. 10 seconds here. We straighten that arm. Last one. And let's flip it over. Right into it, bring those knees in, out. Up, down. If you just want to focus on bringing the knees in here, we want to keep that low back glued to the mat, okay? So if the leg raise forces that low back off the mat, do not do it. Good job. We're going to go right into our next round, okay? And let's use that momentum. Back up to the feet, let's go. Side step, jack, Woo. Three rounds, 30 seconds each. You probably thought I was giving you a break. This is a efficient, well, low ratio work to rest here. Woo. Good job. Less than 10 here, then we come back down. I'm gonna go onto the other side for that sideline push up. Last one. I'm coming down onto my right side. The left arm is gonna be doing the work here. I come on down. Let's go up and down. So really focusing on pressing up with that arm. You can play with the hand placement a little bit here. See what gives you the most support. We have 10 seconds here. Last one. And flip it over. Let's go right into it. We come in, out, up, and down. Good job. Try not to swing those legs. Ten seconds. We go back up for that third round, right into it. that momentum, let's come back up to the feet. Let's go, right, jack. I'm gonna do 30 seconds each side for that sideline push up. Good job. We're nice and light on those feet, you're halfway here. Oh, I love this song. Two more. Last one. 
And come on down, come down onto my left side. Right arm is going to work. Up and down. Good job. We're trying to straighten that arm. You're halfway. I'll let you know when to switch sides. Woo! Last one on this side. Let's flip it over. A little break dance move here. Let's go with that left arm up. Woo. Good job. Last one with these sideline push-ups. We have two more here. Last one. And we're gonna flip it over right away. We bring those knees in, out, up, and down. Good job. Hugging those knees into the chest. Fifteen seconds here. Trying to keep those legs straight as you bring them up overhead. And rest. Alright, that was five minutes of work straight through. So we're going to have some water here. I wanted to keep this one around 30 minutes. So what we're going to do is a three minute finisher straight through, okay? So for this finisher, I have three moves, 30 seconds a piece. You're going all the way through, no rest. Too much what we just did, okay? A little bit shorter, actually. So first move that we're going to do is going to be a um, sprawl with a plank jack. So we're going to come down plank jack at the bottom, you come up to that squat position, okay? That's exercise number one. If you want something a little bit lower impact, what you're gonna do instead, we tap right, left, we come up on the tippy toes, back down, right, left, up, down, okay? That's exercise number one. Number two, I feel like I have to do some push-ups. So what you're gonna do, we're gonna come down into a knee push-up, so I'm gonna shoot those hips forward, then those triceps in nice and close, we're gonna come up to that plank, bring the knees up, one, two, three, four, back down, little push up. So I like doing a knee push up instead of a hand release, um, kind of mixing it up a bit. If you want to do a hand release push up from the toes instead, you can. So that would look like this, we come down, release, you press back up. Then we go for those four mountain climbers, okay? Last move that we're going to do, really hammer out that core, you're going to go for alternating V-ups. I come down, I reach for that opposite foot. Modified version, oblique twist. I'm reaching for the inside of the ankle. Okay? Let's get going here. Three minutes straight through. Starting with that uh, plank jack. Okay. In four, three, two. Let's go here. Woo. So sprawl to that plank jack, or you're doing the two taps, right, left, Good job. Whatever you need here, quick 30 minute sweat. Woo. And come on down to that high plank position. Push up. We come up. Four mountain climbers. Good job, you're halfway. Drive those knees to chest. And let's flip it over, right to those alternating V-ups or the oblique twist. We're only going through two rounds here, okay? Reaching for that opposite foot. Less than 10 seconds here. Last one. Come back up to the feet. Let's go to that sprawl again. Round two of two. You're almost there. Go. 
push up to those four mountain climbers. And we're keeping those hips forward here for that push up from the knees. off with that core. Last push up, let's go. And flip it over. We're finishing off last 30 seconds here. You're almost there. Up and down. Ooh. I'm going to add a 30 second plank on. I changed my mind. <laughs> Good job. Seconds here, then we flip it over. We're holding that plank for 30 seconds. Last one. And flip it over, you're holding here. You have 30 seconds of gas left in the tank. Whew. Almost there. 15 seconds, if you want to make this a bit more challenging, add a little hip dip. Over and back. Good job. Five seconds here. Hold that plank. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Bring that forehead down to rest. That was a speed workout. That forehead comes down onto the mat. We can reach those arms forward into that child's pose. Bring those arms in behind the back, pulling back here, opening up through that chest. We just worked. Whew. All right, I'm not gonna keep you here for a stretch. Thank you so much. That was a fun one. I promise I will be recording more. I apologize for the delay. <laughs> Have a good night. Thanks, everyone.